These glasses are totally bent. We are here in Chamonix and we are heading over to the Salon de Ultra Trail. Havelina 100 has a booth and we're going to set up and Haley still doesn't have her bag. Haley's pissed. Yeah, so we're pissed. We're gonna go. In the car. Do you know which booth we're in? Uh, nope. Okay. Sure no. Did you want? Wow. Okay. Get this bag, are there bags in the car? I do need shoes. <laughs> now I did it. Straight across, I think. I think this is the red. That's your right. I say that. Yeah. Oh, oh. yeah. We got a ticket. Nice. <laughs> well, we're not collecting tickets then. It's always beeping like crazy. It's always beeping. Go around that set and you should find it over there. Otherwise, just hang out. All right, I'll be back. All right, I dropped off Haley in the car and I'm on my way back over. What I just found out. Check this out. First glance, we've got these windows. You can see outside. Watch this. Yeah. A perfect view. UTMB. The race literally runs right down here. That's the start the main strip. Up there you got people flying around. Crazy. Really big peaks over that way. Friends from the Ultra Trail World Tour hooked us up, hooked me up. So I got a new pair of New Balance 910s. Because your luggage is still missing. My luggage is, yeah, I mean, I have nothing. There's still a few things I don't have, but I now have the essentials. I have shoes. They're fly looking too. <laughs> I know. And then I got two different pairs because I couldn't have just one. I got the UTMB Custom Compression Socks. And I got another pair of compression socks. So I have socks now, which is positive. 
And then, really cool, is this new company called Uglo that makes super lightweight, packable, fully rain and... UTMB compliant? UTMB compliant. Can I get one of those? <laughs> I don't know, you gotta ask them. <laughs> Maybe you gotta lose your luggage. That's awesome. It has like a built-in hood thing too. Yep. All right, so we're gonna get our stuff together and go check in. We should probably do that Maybe. earlier. Yeah. Okay, I think it's gonna be busy. All right, get my kit together here. We're gonna go in over to check in. They make us take all this required gear, even when it's gonna be like 80 degrees this week. Rain gear. Long sleeve base layer, shirt, and leggings. Emergency blanket, headlamp, food reserves. We're off to get to check in. Oh, I opened the door the right way. We're also doing air vibe stuff. Yeah, I saw you had a booth. Yeah, we have the booth for Havelina because it's part of Ultra Trail World Tour. You're doing cool. the big one? The big boy. Yeah. Not not PTL big boy, but you can Well, no, boy. that's that's insane. Any advice? I started slow and then I felt really good after mile 30 and I started picking it up. Yeah. And then I just blew myself out. So. Yeah. Required items I need to get. Finished up a jam-packed day. I'll be in the booth all day tomorrow and I'm all checked in for my race. So American Meredith Edwards is on her way and she's second in TDS. I'm gonna see if I can try and catch her at the finish. It is like one in the morning right now. Tell us about your journey. It was a long one, 19 hours. I came out here to run and I didn't expect anything to happen and I'm just so happy right now. 